We're joined on the phone today by actress Sophia Lillis. You might remember her from the uh, film It that just came out a while back and a couple other things as well. But her new film, Nancy Drew and the Hidden Staircase, is out now. Hey, Sophia, how you doing today? Sophia, how you doing today? Doing well, thank you. It's great to be speaking with you. Thank you so much for joining me. Of course. Well, let's talk about uh, your new movie here, Nancy Drew and the Hidden Staircase. Uh, a lot of the listeners, I'm sure, are familiar with Nancy Drew, but can you tell us uh, a bit about the movie? What are we in for? Um, well, of course, you follow Nancy Drew, uh, the character. Uh, and it's kind of, kind of the origin of Nancy Drew and kind of how she uh, becomes, you know, the person we know, um, uh, this kind of like this sleuth um, of sorts. Um, but uh, it's kind of how she, she moves into River Heights uh, um, and kind of how she um, kind of uh, how she grows from there, how she uh, meets new friends and uh, um, kind of adjusted to this new town and, um, and uh, kind of how, sh- how she um, solves this mystery about the haunted house and, uh, um, and kind, of, uh, kind of learns how much she loves uh, solving mysteries along the way. Excellent, and the film uh, is out digitally, and it'll be on Blu-ray and, and DVD. Were you a fan of Nancy Drew before you signed on for the film? Um, I've heard of her. I actually didn't really read any of her books, but uh, my parent, my, uh, um, I think my mom um, and my grandma and uh, some aunts, my aunts and uncles have uh, even uncles have read uh, Nancy Drew. So I, I, I kind of knew about her growing up, and uh, so after that, I kind of sat, they always they let me their Nancy Drew books so I could read them um and uh, now I now I know who Nancy Drew is (laughs) (laughs) most definitely (laughs) awesome yeah definitely um a character that spanned generations and uh, a lot of uh, fun for families Uh, I noticed uh in the trailer you're doing some pretty uh fancy skateboarding was that something you had to master for the film (laughs) Yeah, a lot of that was actually not me. <laughs> but that was a stunt double. But yeah, no, I learned how to uh, do some. Uh, I, I learned how to st- at least stay on the board and get uh, <laughs> get out every day and uh, kind of uh, use this uh, use the longboard. Uh, um, kind of know how to use it. Uh, went out into the park and everything. But uh, yeah, no, I, I I think I'm okay at skateboarding. I, I'm decent. I know how to stay on. Like I know how to move along and swerve <laughs> but <laughs> n- no no flips just yet well again uh, nancy drew and the hidden staircase is out now and i imagine with a character like this uh, maybe we could see you uh, becoming uh, kind of a part of a franchise maybe reprising this role a few other times down the road yeah i mean there's a lot of content there's like over 100 books so i'm pretty sure um if they do they have a, they, they can definitely make a new movie well, you're pretty early into your acting career, but uh, you've already landed some pretty big roles. Uh, how has that been for you? I guess uh, juggling acting with you know school and and just you know regular teenage stuff. Uh, it's a, it's a little tough, um, kind of uh, you know if I kind of schoolwork and uh, acting. Um, I do have a tu- uh, it is a, a, you're supposed to have a tutor on set to um, spend a few hours um, outside of work to um, kind of catch up with your. Uh, with uh, schoolwork, but uh, it is it is hard to juggle, um, and it, it's hard to make uh, plans with friends. Uh, if in any second you can, uh, 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 one of those days that you uh, work in, in order to you know see your friends, it's going to be probably be busy uh, with working. So uh, it's hard to it's hard to make plans. That's for sure. But uh, it's. Uh, um, after I finish school, I think it's going to be a lot, lot easier. I'm going to take a break or two just to, just to work on acting, you know. And uh, maybe with that, I can have a, a less busy life. <laughs> <laughs> well, of course, um, like a lot of people, I first saw you in the remake of It, and I imagine that role has probably opened up a lot of uh, doors for you. So I'm guessing uh, you're probably going to be getting uh, even busier here soon. No, oh, yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah, it, it did, it did kind of jumpstart my career that was kind of my first really big big studio film um so uh uh that 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 kind of did was like a kind of a jumpstart to my uh to my job 
Well, I know the uh, second half of that story kind of focuses more on the adult versions uh, of your characters, but can you give us any hints on uh, what you'll be doing in the next It film? Are you going to be involved in a lot of new scenes? Or? Uh, yeah, well, uh, it's mostly just flashbacks. Uh, we we are in it a little bit. We did shoot a little bit, a uh, uh, few flashbacks, but we're not really in, you know, the present because that's, that's, it's mostly the adult. Um uh, yeah, I actually honestly don't really know a lot about it because uh, they kind of shot the uh, the adults and the children separately. Um, they finish shooting the adults and then they start shooting the kids. So um, when my the, or whenever it comes out the premiere, that's going to be my first time ever really seeing the whole uh, well everything. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Ken, uh, I know you were the only girl in the group for it, but um, in it, Nancy Drew and the Hidden Staircase, uh, it's got a lot of uh, female representation of uh, both, you know, on screen and yeah. off the screen. Yes, that is true. Uh, it's mostly it's mostly uh, uh, the uh, uh, women uh, on for the crew. There are some men, but uh, it's mostly it is mostly women. Even the director and the uh, um, the, the script supervisor and. Uh, um, all, a lot of these uh, roles that I usually see women, um, and I'm sorry, usually see men, uh, were actually women on set. So it was uh, very refreshing. Excellent. Yeah, it's it's about time. I'm sure you don't need to hear me say that, but <laughs> it's great that things are going that way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, Sophia, what's uh, what's next for you? Uh, obviously, Nancy Drew uh, just out, but do you have anything else maybe we should be looking out for? Uh, well, uh, I just finished shooting, uh, another horror film, surprise, uh, called, uh, uh, Gretel and Hansel, which is basically about the story of Hansel and Gretel, but the title switched. And, and it's more of kind of, uh, it is kind of more of a feminist version. Um, you kind of get to know more, uh, kind of it's a more twisted version of, uh, uh, even more twisted, uh, version of Hansel and Gretel, which is fun. It was really fun to shoot. Um, and a thing that I'm starting to shoot is uh, a kind of a family uh, drama movie called um, Uncle Frank, which is uh, directed by Alan Ball, the person who did Six Feet Under, which I okay. um, I actually really love that shit. So it was fun to work with. Awesome. Well, again, uh, Nancy Drew and the Hidden Staircase is out now. Great speaking with you, and um, I'm glad I got you here uh, early on before you become uh, an even bigger star, and uh, maybe I won't get a chance to speak with you again, but... <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. <laughs> That's so sweet. Thanks so much. All right, you bet. Bye-bye. And again, that was Sophia Lillis, star of the film It, and also the new one, Nancy Drew and the Hidden Staircase, and that one is available now.